ICC conducted its latest draw on 15th March. After a pause of over two draws, ICC conducted a draw with a big draw size, but of course the cutoff score had to go up. This means that the pool breakdown should be interesting to see. Let's find out. Hello and welcome to Canadian Dream. This channel is all about Canadian immigration, immigration related news and updates. In today's video, we'll talk about the latest X% draw result. We'll try to break down the pool size and do some analysis on it. So, RCC conducted the latest expository draw on 15th March 2023. 7,000 invitations were sent out and the cutoff score was 490. Let's move to the expository pool, break it down and analyze it. RCC shared a pool breakdown as of 15th March and this is how it looked. This shows the number of candidates in each range on the day of the draw. So when the draw is conducted, it would impact these numbers. We can see there were 784 candidates in the 601 to 1200 range, 3216 candidates in the 501 to 600 range, 2603 in the 491 to 500 range, 12183 in the 481 to 490 range. If we subtract the number of candidates left in the pool after the last draw from this table, we can find the number of new addition to the pool. I have done it for you and here is the result. In the range of 601 to 1200, 784 were added. Between 501 to 600, 1148. Between 491 to 500, 847. Between 481 to 490, 57 candidates were added. The number of new addition to the pool is very critical for us. After the draw size, this plays the most significant role in deciding the cutoff score. So let's dive deeper to understand how the number of new addition is changing. To understand the pattern of new additions better, let's look at the latest trends. In the 601 to 1200 range, we can see a rise this time, but the trend line is going down. The 501 to 600 range also has a rise and the trend line is going down. The 491 to 500 range witnesses similar pattern. On the whole, the number of new candidates adding to the pool has reduced during the pause. Do you think this will shoot up in the next draw? On the first March's draw, there was a discrepancy in the data. There were 606 candidates in the 601 to 1200 range. The draw issued 667 ideas, yet the cutoff score was above 600, whereas it should have been below 600. It looks like RCC has been facing some glitches in their system since they implemented the tier system. Could this be the reason behind the recent pause? Did they take time to fix the glitches? Let's find out. So, what does the pool look like after the draw? On the 15th of March, 7000 invitations were sent out and the cutoff score was 490. From the 7000 invitations, 784 were used up by the candidates with 600 plus scores. After this, there were 6216 ideas in hand. 3216 ideas were dedicated to the 501 to 600 range to cover all candidates in this range. There were 3000 ideas left. The 491 to 500 range had 2603 candidates, so this range was covered too, leaving 397 ideas in hand. There were 12183 candidates in the 481 to 490 range. So after sending out 397 invitations, there should be 11,786 candidates left in the range. So that's the pool breakdown after the draw on 15th of March. Now if you have been watching my videos carefully, you should be able to make your prediction by looking at this table. If you are able to calculate and come up with a prediction, let me know by commenting below. If you want to know my prediction, I'll try to share it in the next couple of days. The numbers look alright now and it is possible that RCC took time to fix bugs in their system. What do you think was the reason behind the recent pause? I hope this video was helpful, please let me know if you liked it or if you have any problem understanding my explanation and analysis. Your feedback can help me make better videos for you. To get regular updates on ExpressNT, do subscribe and click on the bell icon. You can also follow me on Facebook and Instagram. I'm also available on TikTok right now. You can follow me there as well. I try to share regular updates on my socials. That's all for today. Thank you for watching.